What's up, guys? So another post, another comment from this sad-ass old man that doesn't know anybody but assumes he knows everybody. And if you don't agree with his opinion, he puts you on a list as somebody that agreed with everything with Ryan Upchurch said about Kylie Rodney, which I don't agree with a fucking thing Ryan Upchurch said about Kylie Rodney, but this dumbass put me in that fucking category. So I put him in the go-after-his-ass category. And when he says something stupid or does something stupid, I'm going to call him out for the fucking rest of his fucking miserable life. So here we go. It says, did he destroy dude's career or is he powerless? Pick a lane. And Psycho Bell put, his intentions were to impose maximum damage. Now, since you're slow, let me help you. Hmm. This guy is asking lawsuits like literally psycho babble is asking for people to start suing him that's what's gonna happen if he keeps fucking doing this stupid shit you can only keep pissing off people for so long before they start pissing you off by suing your ass for the stupid shit you keep saying to people i don't care talk about me all you want to just bring views to my channel so talk the fuck away old man but somebody's not going to look at it the same fucking way as me. And please, please, by all means, go on your channel and say that I'm a low life, don't know anything, don't own anything, never amount to anything, piece of shit, like you always tell everybody. Please do that. But let's read what he said, and then I'll tell you some more. It says, it's like to you saying na na boo boo to some dude. What the fuck, Psycho Babble? Are you two, buddy? I thought you were 65, but you're acting like you're fucking one. And in return, he pokes out your eyes with a red hot... F I'm, I'm not even going to read that. Basically, he's saying that somebody should end J.D. King's life. Is basically what he said there. You poke somebody's eyes out with a red-hot fireplace poker. That's You're, you're probably not going to live through that. And, and this guy just said this in a comment. And people are okay with what this dumbass keeps saying to people. And he always goes like, You live in a basement with your mom, blah, 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 blah. Yep, that's what I do, guys. I live in a basement. No basement in my house. It's just a one-level house. Like, three bedrooms, two baths, dining, kitchen, living room, uh, washroom, full-size walk-in closet that I paid for with my own money. Oh, and then I own the property next door, across the street. Which is an eight car garage with freaking uh, office space in the front, uh, a small single wide trailer, and a big uh, shed off to the side on five acres. And then I own the property next to that, which is a just, uh, there's a creek that goes through it. It's just, I just wanted it because, well, I didn't want somebody else to own it. And then I own my brother's property that my brother lives at. His house. I own his house. Would I ever take it from him? No, that's my brother. But I do own the house that he lives in. But yep, I'm one of those low IQ people that you always talk about, Psycho Babble. You fucking idiot. The only low IQ person is you. You.